Hello and welcome back. This day is the major release 28 of OBS has been released. In February 2020, in my video audio from Reaper to OBS that you find above in the description, I explained to you how to perform routing from Reaper to OBS but with the OBS version 27 and the drivers available at that time. With the update of OBS to version 28, many received an incompatibility warning screen regarding various plugins. Here you see mine, it was larger, but I have already taken steps to update many of them. The plugin you are interested in is WinAsia. The development status of the missing plugins can be found on a dedicated page. To monitor it, the link is below in the description box. The replacement plugin that allows the same functionality on OBS 28 is called OBS Asia Bus Asia. It is currently at the version 3.1.2, link in the description. Download the zip file from GitHub. It doesn't have the installer, but it's very easy to be installed. When downloaded, open Explorer to the folder where OBS Studio is located. From the zip, select both folders and drag them to the main OBS folder allowing Windows to override the data. If you haven't already done so, go on to update OBS, otherwise just run OBS version 28. This is the version 28 of OBS with which I'm recording this video. The new driver has overwritten the old one and there is not any need to readjust the settings. Here you see those of the microphone. The first and the second tracks are muted the third is dedicated to UMC Asia driver for the microphone recording the voice guide for editing. You can see it on the viewmeter. Here you see the settings dedicated to Reaper. They have remained intact and referring to reroute. In Reaper, I prepared a song I produced by La Conmigo by Barbara Vagnini. The link is below in the description. Hey baby, what's up? I got a bag. I got a boogie. I got the band. Here are my separate guidance voice, which is recorded on track 3. For the way it's made, by like this video you make the YouTube search engine understand that the content of this video can be helpful for other ones who have the same your problem. And if you like, subscribe, so you will receive notifications of other tutorials that may be useful to you guys. This is collaboration. That's all for now, thanks for watching.